Oxnard Power Plant, Oxnard, California. This is right on the beach. It's a regular power plant. It's not a nuclear power plant. But the California coast isn't ready to get hit by a tsunami. This power plant's only a few hundred yards from the ocean. And nothing to prevent the tsunami from slowing down or to be stopped. If the power gets taken out in Ventura County by a tsunami, how would the residents get help, call for help, and run emergency equipment with no electricity? In my eyes and the eyes of the world, California needs to start being prepared for a natural disaster such as an earthquake, a tsunami, and anything in between. And we're not. This is just many of the power plants all over California. Not including the nuclear power plants scattered all over the country. that are built to stand the earthquakes that we get, but not for the disaster of the tsunami to follow. Here's another view of the Oxnard power plant. Just some people standing over there. Show you the distance from the ocean to the plant. There's the ocean right there. A few hundred yards away from this plant. between the plant and the Pacific Ocean. You can see the fence line, the, the perimeter of the power plant. You know, trespassing signs all along. This 
power plant pumps out warm water that's being used by the plant which gets pumped out into the ocean which actually is creating a shark breeding ground. They actually come over here to breed because of this power plant being so close to the ocean and the uh, water being warmed up by it. They actually come out here to breed. I'm a avid surfer as is my brother. He's in Iraq as we speak. Working. He I myself have seen sharks out here and he has seen uh, 10 to 12 footers going between a couple people before. Surface sea sharks, this beach is a little, a little eerie, a little eerie for me. But here's a power plant in the ocean and the tsunami when it hits California is going to take that out. Electrical plants all along the coast. And emergency crews are gonna have difficulty trying to power equipment or even get or communicate to people or each other. You can see back in the distance behind the power plant our mountains. Those are the Ventura Foothill Mountains. And all along, it's difficult to see, it's not a clear day today. But behind that is all mountains and national forest. Now back here, you can't see, it's difficult to see because of the sand dunes. That's just all fields back there houses, nothing really to stop a tsunami from surging over into the town. Ventura County is a big valley and as you can see when we look this way down the beach you can actually see beachfront homes all along the coast and there's hundreds of these homes right along the coast. Nothing to stop the wave from coming in and surging over and taking everything out. And this goes all the way down the beach for miles. All the way to Silver Strand Beach, which you can't see because it's not a clear day, but it goes all the way down the beach. Here's the ocean. The distance is just so close. Turn back, panning left to see the electric power plant, which would also be in the waves path. And right on the other side of this power plant is a natural river mouth leading out into the ocean, which would mean it would be a vein for the water to surge even farther into the city. California is not ready. 